This is the Rope Masters Video Cast, your source for the best in rope skipping instruction. Hosted by world champion Peter Nessler. Kelsey is back again. She's been, you know, featured on quite a few video casts, but she's just such a great instructor that I was very happy to have her back uh, for another one. She's going to be doing three wheel. Um, she'll be doing some uh, more skills with this. The varsity skill with three wheel is very difficult. Um, it's a lot of fun to do, but it takes a lot of practice to get. And yeah, it's called the Nagam, and you know, it's something you'll really, really enjoy once you get it. But it's something that just takes a lot of work, and it looks really cool. So hope you enjoy these. Um, like I said before, with three wheel, just work really really hard to get these. They're not something you're going to pick up the first time you try it. You're going to have to work and work and work with your partners to get them. The JV skill. Our JV three-wheel trick is going to be crosses. And since the ropes are too short for all of us to cross at the same time, we're all going to cross at a separate time. So we're going to start with Nick, and he's going to do a cross that's similar to two-wheel. So he's going to cross his right arm over, put his left arm on top, then take out his right arm, then finally take out his left arm. And Mike's going to do the same thing. He's going to cross over his right, left, right, left. And the middle person has a job that's a little bit different since our arms are coming at the same time. I need to make sure that when I cross, I just do a big cross at the same time, but I really have to jump high through this rope. And my partners need to jump high too because that rope is going to be shared by two people at one time. So big jump through there, and we clear the cross. So we'll go ahead and show you what it looks like, one at a time, Nick, myself, and then Mike will jump. So ready, set, go. Ready, set, ooh, we had a little mistake there. Try again, start again. Make sure you jump high. Ready, set, go, Nick crosses. Ready, set, go, I cross. And my crosses. And that is the basic cross in three ways. Varsity skill. Our varsity trick is the nagam, and it's performed in three wheel. And it's basically a series of switches in which two people are switching, and one person is turning around backwards. So during this switch, there's going to be a lot of changing from arms together to arms separated, and also from going forward to going backward. So what we'll do first is Mike and I are going to switch places. I'm going to go in front of him, and Nick is going to turn around backwards, and he's going to turn towards me, so towards his left. So we'll show you that first switch. We'll say, ready, set, go, switch, and we make it to this spot. The next part of the switch we're going to do is swing these ropes over our head. And I'm going to be the one who's turning around backward as Mike and Nick switch places. So I'm going to say, ready, set, go, we'll switch. I turn inward and Mike switches in front of Nick, and we'll swing the ropes over our head. This time, Nick and I are going to switch places while Mike turns around, and we're all going to end up facing backward. So we go ready, set, go, switch, and we've all ended up in the same position, just flipped around, and we're facing backward. So we'll go ahead, go back to the beginning, we'll walk through that one more time. Make sure our ropes are situated here. Uh-oh, I went the wrong way. The most challenging part about wheels is keeping the ropes right and getting them back situated after we've walked through something. So I'll say, ready, set, go on the outside ropes. They'll swing over our head. So we're just going to walk through it one more time. And Mike and I switch places. Nick turns around backward. Nick and Mike switch places. I turn around backward. And Nick and I switch places, and Mike turns around backwards. That will be our final position. So we'll go back and show you. And when you're first beginning this skill, you probably will want to say ready, set, go in between each switch. But after you've worked on a lot and feel comfortable with it, you want to just go ready, set, go, switch, take a jump, switch, take a jump, and switch. So we'll show you that way with just one jump in between. So here it is all together. Ready, set, go. I'll count the outside ropes. Ready, set, go. Switch, switch, and switch. And at the end of the skill, you should all be turning backwards and facing backwards. And that is the Nagam. For more information, check out www.jumprm.com.